School nutrition leaders here at the Capitol today all in an effort to promote healthy eating with young people across the state of Connecticut. Maureen, Kate and Chris, you folks are on the front lines in all of this. Maureen, to get a nutritious meal on the plate and more importantly into a mouth of a young person, why is that so key? just important to have children eating healthy food, fresh fruits, fresh vegetables from our local farmers. Keith, I think it's just, it's a win-win. Children who are, are not hungry are going to learn better in school. And Kate, if we tap into the news of the day recently, the legislature approving meals at no charge to kids, at least temporarily. How has that been a game changer in the work that you try to do every day? More kids are getting meals. They learn better when they're nourished properly. We're hoping that the governor will continue this funding for Meals at No Charge for Kids into next year. We don't want parents and kids to worry about where their next meal is going to come from. And Chris, in the eyes of your organization, you say this is win-win because we're also supporting locally grown suppliers at the same time? Absolutely. It's a trickle-down effect from the top down. Um, as we serve more meals, as our counts go up at, for school lunch and breakfast, uh, we have to purchase more products product, which in return helps the farmers. So it's it's an absolute win-win. All right. Appreciate your time. Know that this is a topic that parents and grandparents are watching very closely. We are Connecticut's news station. We will continue to do the same. But for now, under the Golden Dome in Hartford, I'm Keith McGilvery, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.